Oh, I need to remember to take a freaking thumbnail. Okay. I'm really excited to film this for you guys. I'm doing some liquid lips. I uh, recently saw Tati Westbrook do a review on these Le Macron, Le Macron, <laughs> uh, L'Oreal Infallible Lips. The shades I got were an 824 and 828. This one is Guava Gush. This one is Fran Boys Frenzy. And I meant to get another one, but they did not have it at the Walmart where I picked it up. I ordered them online and then picked it up in store, which was really cool, by the way. I wasn't expecting for them to have such a cool, like, mechanism for picking up your orders. <laughs> but what I was getting to was I meant to get another color, uh, Mon Caramel, Mon Caramel. <laughs> And that one was more of a nudie, your lips but better type of shade that I really would have enjoyed, okay? Because I really don't wear these types of colors. I mean, it's summer, so maybe, who knows? But because I couldn't find those, I went ahead and got some other in that same line. <laughs> um, just a different, what is this, a subsector? I don't know. And actually, I believe these were the original ones that came out before the... Les Macarons line. <laughs> so this one is Le Chocolates and this is in the shade 854 Bittersweet. Wow, cute name, love that. And this one is in 354 Nudist. So, and I'm actually really glad I got these in really similar shades because this one is looking a little dry and also this backing right here it was already open so i don't know if someone already used this somehow but like i said it's dried out so and i don't know if you guys have seen the crazy stuff that people are doing in grocery stores licking ice cream putting it back and then with um or eating the ice cream and putting it back but i'm not taking any chances with lipstick so we'll put that one back <laughs> so we're down to three liquid lips but this way we get to you know try out these and then kind of compare it to the original formula um here's my handy dandy mirror and so i'll put this one away so it's opened gross um honestly i want to try the original one first this one wasn't open. I just broke the seal. Oh, look at that. Clean, brand new little lippy. Okay. Oh, okay. Mm. Okay, definitely smells kind of sweet. <laughs> kind of sweet, kind of sunscreeny. I don't, I don't know quite what's going on there. Um, once again, this is in the color Nudist. Ooh, I love a good nude shade. Okay, right off the bat, interesting doe foot okay we'll see about this one i guess this is, it's good to get in like the corners of your lips we'll see okay so i'm just gonna go ahead apply it and i'll let you guys know what i think right off the bat i can tell you it feels really smooth going on um uh, as i'm kind of puckering or pursing my lips together it's getting sticky so we'll see how that goes okay i don't know if i'm crazy about this applicator because it's not really that stiff it kind of just bends everywhere so i don't know i really like this color i don't know why the shape of it looks weird should i just connect this Let's you know what, let's do the Kim Possible lip. Y'all know what I'm talking about? Oh, yeah, yeah. I'm your basic average girl. Where she has this connected. Oh, yes. It's a look. Okay. Um, wow, yeah, this is 
Okay, this is kind of cool. Okay. My only complaint right now, it feels really gloppy and sticky. Really gloppy. Yeah, okay. Maybe, who knows, maybe it's different with these colors. Maybe, I mean, this line, maybe it's a little more wearable. Oh, yeah, I don't know. You know what I will say though? I could see this being very long lasting. Just, you know, you wouldn't have to be re reapplying all night, but yeah. Oh, see, maybe it's drying down a little bit more. It starts feeling a lot smoother, more of like a satin finish on your lips. Okay. Okay, cool. But yeah, overall, I love the color. Um, not crazy about the applicator, but yeah, it's, and it's feeling, like I said, the more it dries down, the better it's feeling on my lips. So give me a quick second. I'm just going to wipe this one off. Oh my God. This is so hard to get off right now. Mm. That's going to have to do because that, oh my God, I was scrubbing to get that off. Now let's get into these little babies. Also cute. Kind of matches my nails. Um, let's see. So this one is in the shade Guava Gush. Let's see how this one smells. Oh, look at that. A brand new one. Love it. Oh, it's like they were going for a fruity smell, but it's kind of just, kind of smells like Clorox <laughs> or Lysol. <laughs> so this is Guava Gush. I'm just going to go ahead and place this now. Oh, okay. Mmm. So same thing with this applicator, not crazy about it. I want it to be like a little sturdier. Um, yeah, see how it just kind of, it just like flops whenever it goes on. Uh, really great pigment on these though. Um, it's like the color on the package is the color. Like you see that color. Okay, really cute color. I'm not crazy about it when I look up close. It looks better from afar, <laughs> if that helps. Um, yeah, see, I think the same case with this one where it's feeling like it will dry down to more of a satin smooth finish, but for right now, it feels like paint. So before this one dries down really quick, like the other one, I'm gonna go ahead and take it off. So the next color I have is this way. Oh, you can't even read that probably. Well, it's Friend Boys <laughs> Frenzy. And I'm hoping I really like this color because if so, that'd be really fun for the summer. Once again, Woo, look at that brand new, so clean same little janky applicator but whatever let's get to applicating okay i kind of look like a clown but it's kind of cute for some reason this one doesn't feel as sticky um yeah that colors i mean the color payoff you get with these is really amazing. And like I said, I can see them being so long lasting considering how tough it is just to take it off with a baby wipe. Um, you're definitely going to need some sort of oil-based makeup remover to take this off. But yeah, if you're, if you're looking for a long wearing lip that is not joking around, I mean, these babies are it. This is it right here. So, but yeah, overall, I think they're a lot of fun for the summer and um, I'd be really excited to kind of try them out on a night out to see how long wearing they are. Like I said, I see them being, you know, very durable. It's just the only thing is you have to get over that stickiness for a little bit in the beginning. But yeah, yeah, I think I like them. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. 
give me a thumbs up and like the video if you enjoyed it and oh yeah subscribe turn on the notification bell all that good stuff i don't know what i'm doing okay <laughs>